Lyme disease is kind of a tough diagnosis for most uh, practitioners unless it's endemic in your area. Um, I end up coming across it from time to time as a rule out uh, from other problems. Uh, usually it's, uh, it, it comes, it, you know, shows up as an arthritis, but then when you go back and look at a history, the horse has had kind of like a, a, a history of, a, of maybe a, a bout with a fever, the sort of thing, and then all of a sudden they're uncomfortable and they have kind of a generalized discomfort to them. Uh, they don't ex examine exactly like any other disease process and you almost you know end up coming up with it by as a rule out diagnosis from other things and then we go ahead and run a titer on them and we find that they have you know they have Lyme disease and the best treatment or the only treatment that we know of is go ahead and put them on a tetracycline derivative uh, long-term treatment and which most horses respond to quite nicely but Usually it's a rule out diagnosis from uh, chronic arthritis or, or discomfort that you can't really put your finger on anything in particular. It's just not uh, localized in one problem. One of the complications of Lyme disease is that they become extremely lame and just uncomfortable in a number of different areas and they can't perform anymore. And I've seen jumpers with it, uh, horses uh, from back east where you see a little bit more commonly. Uh, Lyme disease is quite prevalent, uh, primarily in the eastern United States, but we've seen it uh, disseminate throughout, uh, you know, other places throughout the, the Midwest. Uh, but I haven't seen too many cases out in the, in the far west, but usually eastern U.S., mid-Atlantic region, primarily from Connecticut down to uh, mid-Atlantic states thereabouts, you know, our, uh, let's say Virginia, North Carolina, and as far west as Kentucky. The biggest problem is it's vectors uh, that will carry the, the disease uh, is the biggest problem. You gotta be careful uh, of uh, ticks and uh, certain biting flies, things like this, but mainly insects will carry it and, and give it to uh, horses or people as well.